Another reason why I'm bringing my hives in right away is as you can see, skunk. And skunks are relentless, they just keep coming back for till they fill their stomachs before they head in for hibernation. And it's quite obvious you see a bunch of pawing in the front of the colonies. So they just scratch at the entrance and as the bees come out, they just kind of lap them up. I've noticed since I've started keeping my hives up on pallets, the distance here, it uh, forces a skunk to have to reach up. I think that um, when the skunk reaches up, it exposes their belly. They don't like getting stung in the belly. So ever since I've been putting my hives up on pallets like this, the uh, losses to my hives have dramatically decreased. Because I know when I catch a swarm in uh, throughout the summer and I put them on the ground, like on a bottom board right on the ground, those hives pretty much get cleaned out in the fall. Well, because it's the only one in the yard of pallets, so the skunks go and pick on them. So anyways, and look at this. This Carrie caught a red squirrel in another yard of mine, pushing pails off and um, getting a little sugar treat. And did it pretty much to every pail in the yard, the damn thing. They're also taking my corks out, because I think they know, or they knew that there was patty underneath. And if they took the cork out, they get a tasty little protein treat. So it's probably what he's looking for still. These damn squirrels. Raccoons are also a trouble for me. Uh, they come in there more annoying than anything. They push the pails off and take the lids off. And take my corks out to the point where I actually have to put these corks in from the inside. So they can't pull the corks out, which is really annoying. Anyway, it's certainly not da bear damage, so it's just complaint. Just about done the load, I'll get her in and be done for the day.